Welcome to a world where saving money and living well aren't mutually exclusive. Did you know that the average American spends over $1,800 on clothes annually, yet wears only a fraction of their wardrobe regularly? Imagine converting even half of that expense into savings while still dressing stylishly and enjoying life's pleasures. Frugal living often carries the stigma of sacrifice, but what if you could embrace it without giving up what you love? This series will unveil not just how to save money, but how to enhance your lifestyle while doing so. From transforming old items into trendy decor to gourmet meals on a budget, you'll discover that being frugal can be surprisingly fun and chic. Get ready to explore nine insightful strategies that promise to revitalize your spending habits, decorate your home, and even boost your wardrobe without breaking the bank. Each chapter is packed with simple, actionable tips that will not only save you money, but also enrich your daily life. Let's redefine what it means to live frugally. Join us on this exciting journey to financial freedom and beyond. Chapter 1. The Smart Spender's Strategy Have you ever noticed how some people manage to enjoy life's luxuries while spending much less? The secret lies in adopting a smart spender's mindset. A quote from the financial guru Warren Buffett sums it up nicely. Do not save what is left after spending, but spend what is left after saving. This mentality is about planning your expenses strategically. It's not about deprivation. It's about making smarter choices that align with your financial goals. Firstly, start by tracking where every penny goes. It might sound tedious, but understanding your spending habits is the first step towards financial freedom. A study by the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau showed that households that actively track their spending are more likely to save and have financial stability. Secondly, prioritize your spending. Focus on what brings you joy and cut out the unnecessary. For instance, if you love reading, a library membership could save you hundreds compared to buying books. Lastly, embrace the power of waiting 24 hours before making any non-essential purchase. This simple rule helps curb impulse buys, allowing you to evaluate whether it's a need or a want. Chapter 2. Luxury for Less Smart Shopping Secrets Who says luxury has to break the bank? There are numerous ways to enjoy premium goods without the hefty price tag. For instance, did you know that buying slightly used or refurbished electronics can save you up to 50% off the retail price? Websites like eBay and Amazon offer certified refurbished items that come with warranties. When shopping for clothes, timing is everything. Buying off-season can save you a fortune. A winter coat in spring or a swimsuit in fall can often be found at a discount of 70% or more. This approach not only saves money, but gives you a head start on the next season's wardrobe. Also, don't underestimate the power of negotiation. In many cultures, bargaining is the norm, not the exception. You might feel shy at first, but with a bit of practice, you could reduce costs significantly, especially on big ticket items like furniture or electronics. Chapter three, meal mastery, gourmet on a budget. Imagine eating gourmet style every day without the high cost. It's totally possible with a bit of planning and creativity. Start by planning your meals around what's on sale. This strategy can cut your grocery bills by up to 20%. Always check the weekly flyers or apps for the best deals. Bulk buying is another secret weapon. Staples like rice, pasta, and beans are not only cheaper in bulk, but also last a long time. Combine this with seasonal produce, which is not only more affordable, but also at its peak flavor. Furthermore, embrace the art of cooking at home. A survey by the Bureau of Labor Statistics found that the average American family spends nearly $3,000 a year eating out. Cooking at home not only saves money, but also allows you to control the quality of ingredients, making your meals healthier and more personalized. Chapter four, automate to accumulate. Isn't it amazing when you can save money without even thinking about it? That's the beauty of automating your finances. By setting up automatic transfers to your savings account right after payday, you ensure that saving money isn't just a leftover thought, it's a priority. Financial advisors often say, pay yourself first. This means treating your savings like any other essential bill. Automating bill payments can also save you money in the long run. Avoid late fees, which can sneak up and bite into your budget. A report from the National Foundation for Credit Counseling highlights that late fees can seriously disrupt budgeting, especially for households juggling multiple debts. Moreover, consider setting up alerts for large transactions. This not only helps in managing your budget, but also keeps your accounts secure. In 2020, Approximately 47% of Americans experience some form of financial identity theft, and staying on top of account activity is a crucial preventative measure. Chapter 5. Eco-Chic Living Who knew that going green could save you some serious green? Adopting an eco-friendly lifestyle isn't just good for the planet. It can also be great for your wallet. 
For instance, switching to LED bulbs can save about $225 per household annually. According to the U.S. Department of Energy, they use at least 75% less energy and last 25 times longer than incandescent lighting. Another tip is to cut down on water waste. A simple faucet aerator can save up to 700 gallons of water a year, which not only conserves a vital resource but also reduces your water bill. Lastly, think about buying secondhand. Thrift shops, yard sales, and online marketplaces are treasure troves for those looking to decorate their homes on a budget. It's not uncommon to find high-quality items for less than half the cost of buying new. Plus, reusing items reduces waste and demand for new products, aligning your financial goals with environmental responsibility. Chapter 6. Entertainment Hacks. Fun for free. Fun doesn't have to cost a fortune. There are countless ways to enjoy yourself without spending a dime. Start by exploring local community events. Many cities offer free concerts, art exhibits, workshops, and festivals that are open to the public. Check community boards or town websites for upcoming events. Another great option is the great outdoors. Whether it's hiking, biking, or simply taking a stroll in your local park, nature offers a wealth of opportunities for free entertainment. The National Park Service sometimes offers free entry days throughout the year, which is a perfect opportunity to explore stunning landscapes without a fee. For indoor entertainment, consider online resources like public library access to ebooks, audiobooks, and digital magazines. Most libraries extend these services for free, which can significantly expand your entertainment options without impacting your wallet. Chapter 7 DIY Decor Personalize on a Penny Transforming your home decor doesn't have to drain your wallet. With DIY projects, you can create a personalized space while sticking to a budget. A recent survey indicated that DIY home decorators often spend 60% less than those who buy ready-made items. Start simple. Paint an old piece of furniture instead of replacing it. A fresh coat of paint can completely revitalize an outdated chair or table. Another great DIY project is creating your own wall art. Use fabric scraps, old magazines, or even nature finds from your backyard to create pieces that are uniquely yours. This not only saves money but also gives your home a personal touch that can't be bought in a store. Additionally, consider repurposing items. An old ladder can be turned into a chic bookshelf, and mason jars can become trendy light fixtures. These projects not only cut costs, but also promote recycling, which is good for the planet. Chapter 8. Fashion Forward Frugality Keeping up with the latest fashion trends doesn't mean you have to splurge. Thrift shopping is a goldmine for fashion enthusiasts on a budget. According to a report by ThreadUp, Shopping secondhand can save shoppers up to 90% off retail prices. Not only does this save you money, but it's also a sustainable choice, reducing waste and demand for new resources. Another strategy is to organize clothing swaps with friends or community groups. This is a fun way to refresh your wardrobe without spending any money. Plus, it's a great way to bond over fashion with friends. Finally, learning basic sewing skills can extend the life of your clothing. Simple fixes like sewing a button or patching a tear can save a garment from the landfill. This not only keeps your clothes wearable longer, but also saves you money on replacements. Chapter 9. Investing in Yourself The ultimate way to embrace frugal living without sacrifice is to invest in yourself. Spending money on learning new skills or hobbies can lead to personal and sometimes financial growth. For instance, taking a course in graphic design could allow you to start a freelance side business. Studies show that lifelong learning boosts cognitive function and can even open up new career paths. Consider also investing time in fitness. A healthy lifestyle can reduce future medical costs significantly. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC, regular physical activity can help ward off chronic diseases, potentially saving thousands in future healthcare costs. Lastly, don't forget about mental health. Practices like meditation and mindfulness can improve overall well-being and reduce stress without costing a dime. Many free resources are available online to guide you through these practices enhancing your quality of life and ensuring you remain focused and motivated on your financial journey.